It's like the scripture says, you can, cannot be trusted with the smallest of things, cannot be trusted with the largest of things. And whether or not I am Trump's son, uh, the contrast and the way he copied everything I said and, you know, the things he said and the things that I said and his response to things I said doesn't matter. There's a connection there. And I might be the small things that you cannot be trusted with. And he is the large things that you can't be trusted with. You can't be trusted with handling me and my situation properly in a just and righteous manner. So you're not going to get a chance to handle that situation, which is way bigger, right? In other words, and it has already been stripped from you once, right? And you still haven't learned. You still haven't learned. There's still hope. I mean, if this is the way the story's pl supposed to play out, there's still hope, right? On that aspect, you still don't get it, though. You're not. You're not biting. You're not believing it. You're not even pondering it. <laughs> which even like which like I always say, even if Jesus was the president, it wouldn't matter because we got dumbass people like you. There's no hope. You you can't you can't be a good leader when your people aren't worthy of even being led. It's not possible. Huh. Truth. Sorry. Might hurt a little bit if you're smart enough to even understand what the fuck I'm saying. <laughs> but then at the same time, nothing is what it seems. Maybe he's the small things and I'm the big things. Either way, it doesn't really matter. You can't handle it. You don't deal with any of it the right way. You don't deal with it right, proper at all.